Hi everyone, how are you? This is my first video and I want you to know that I have a special cameraman. Introduce yourself, please. Hi. Okay, so I wanted to just show you an example of in week two, the assignments, there was a letter where you have to read something and then add a summary. I just wanted to show you an example of one that I wrote. For that lesson, you needed your pink anthology. An anthology is a um, collection of stories. And then you could have used your summary resource guide to help you, okay? And I'll be using both of these items. I just wanted to tell you the story I chose to read is lost and found. Raise your hand if you've read that one yet. Oh, wow, a lot of you did. Okay, it's on page, <laughs> it was on page 93. Okay, so if you wanted to go read it after I shared a summary, then you might wanna do that. But so, the activity was to write a letter and include a summary. So I'm just gonna start, actually I'll start by just telling you what a summary is. A summary is, a shortened version of a story. It has a beginning, a middle, and an end. In the beginning, you usually talk about the characters and the setting. In the middle of a summary, you usually talk about what happens, but if there's a problem. In the end, you talk about how the problem was solved. So here's my example of a letter, with all the five friendly letter parts, and a summary. So I'll use my mat magnet wand, and it's April 2nd, 2020. And I wrote my letter to Archie. Dear Archie, how are you? I am doing okay. I miss being in the classroom, but I'm making the best of it. I would like to share a summary of a story I read. It is called The Lost and Found. And usually when we're writing about stories, titles, you underline the title. So I put my summary in green. It says, the story is about three characters, Wendy, Wendell, Floyd, and Mona. They meet while Mona was looking for her hat in the lost and found. We all know what a lost and found is. The story takes a turn when the characters actually fall into the lost and found bin. We have to ask ourselves, can that really happen? No, so it's a fantasy story. The new friends help Mona find her hat while exploring the fantasy land. I talked about that genre, fantasy. And here's my ending. The story ends with Mona, Wendell, and Floyd appearing back at the school, wondering if that just really happened. Happened, I missed an E. And Archie, I hope you enjoy my letter and summary. Talk soon. Miss Layton. One thing before we go up, right? This letter has a date, a greeting, the body, a closing, and my signature. So hopefully you were able to write a letter including a summary of something that you've read. Bye, everyone.